In the name of the king, I hereby sentence you to death. Who? All right, who was that? Oh, that was what's his name? <laughs> oh, oh crap. That's oh, the coal boy. Get over there! This boy has been charged with murdering a loyal servant of the king. Who here bears witness to his crimes? My betrothed can speak to them. Is this true, my lady? He understands. He's got to understand, right? Ah, uh, my lady! Then in the name of the king, I sentence you to die. Lady Mira, please! Uh, please, this isn't right! No, it isn't. Okay. Uh, uh, Come along, uh, Mira. Dang it. I have a busy day ahead. This sucks. This sucks. This sucks. Okay, we're at the White Hill camp. Oh, we just need to take out Lud. Fucking guards. Keep your heads down. We'll have to find a way to distract them. How do they not see me? Just what? How do they not see me? That tower gives a great view over their camp. More guards. Place is crawling with them. Gee, I wonder why. Oh, oh the horses! Been tethered during a battle. If we can just get them loose. Enough thinking. Where do you want us? Get the horses loose. Cut the horses free. Send them galloping through the camp. Horses? That's what you want? That's what we need. A distraction. Fine. But if any White Hills get in our way, might have to cut them loose too. Me Do here once you've done your part. Good luck, Basilisk. Try not to get yourself dead, Westerosi. Huh. I'll take that as a Can form of respect. You can trust them to fight. Beyond that. Come on, let's get this done. Okay, alright. So how are we gonna get from here to Lud's camp? Oh, hello. Hi. What's up? Oh, there's another one. There's another one. Let's over there. Oh. Okay. All right. <laughs> How did that guy not see us? How did he? <laughs> oh, he he's he's up. The All right. They're loose. All right. Cool. All right. Oh, there's Lud. There's Lud and Griff. I need to check out both of them. Kill the Forester boy. Make sure the little shit can't escape. He can't run if he doesn't have legs. Do what you must. And if anything happens to me, kill him. Yes, father. Bring me my great sword. All right. Fuck. All right. What do we do? One of us needs to go after Griff. One of us needs to go after Lud. I want to make him bleed. This might be our only chance. Sorry, Ryan. We will kill Sorry, them, Ryan. And the White Hill army will fall apart. Quick, then. Before he gets away. Don't get too close. Can I... We'll I need to send Beska. We strike. I need to send Beska after Griff. We need to send Beska after Griff. Now. Let's take them. 
I need to send Beska after Griff. What am I doing? Roderick, we should have split the up. Wizard. You've just won this war for me coming here like this. Oh, more White Hills. <laughs> Nothing I can't handle. Good. Which is fine by me. Makes my life that much easier. Call off the attack. Swear fealty to House Forrester, and I'll let you live. Not today. I had to give him the offer. I knew he wouldn't take it, but had to give him the offer. Oh, who's that scared looking guy in the background? Probably a squire or something. X. Come on! So how can we get rid of Griff? Yeah, try the ah, oh, dang it. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Why? Stab him! It's over, Lord. I underestimated you, Cripple. But it won't do you any good. My soldiers are already tearing down your gates. They'll kill your mother, your sisters. For Asha! Goodbye, asshole. All right, but they're okay. So now they're now we need to go get Ryan. We need to we need to kill Griff. We need to kill Griff. Veska. Where's the Rossi? You leave. Where's the basilisk? We were separated during the fight, right before I took Lud's head. He's dead. Good. I thought Beska would be here. Beska will have to Beska. take care of herself. Beska Do probably I went know. after Griff. She has to. Uh. still recording so that's good they're everywhere all right all right buddy uh, I don't know who you are but you're dead oh damn What's the situation here, Don Grim? My lord, the White Hills have broken through, and the rest of their forces are closing in. There's Griff. We need so where's Lud? At the gate. No, we killed Lud. Have you seen Sorry. Mother? Why aren't she? Have you seen Mother? No one knows Get where she is. Now. Okay. So the mother's missing. Oh crap! All of our common folk. Okay. My lord. Your command. Protect our people. Get them away from the battle. Get the small folk out of here. Do it now. Now okay. this is the war, Asha promised. Do Roderick! Get rid of these guys. So, can we actually win this? We need to get Griff. Go after Griff. Get Griff. Ah, I'm glad I saved your life. Ha <laughs> ha 
I'm glad I saved his life. Somebody kill Griff! Go after Griff! Not if we push that to him. Good idea, Westerosi. Let's give those fuckers a welcome to remember. Agreed! Boom, motherfucker! Get Griff! Rush! Ah, oh, son of a whore! Lord Roderick Forrester, last of his kind! Crap. Get him! Stab him! Stab him! Well, all right. I was hoping to face you whole. No matter. I'm sure if I miss any of these, I'm probably going to be dead. Oh, crap. Get him! No! Crap, oh crap. Keep pressing A, keep pressing A. Oh, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Let go of my son! Okay, she's dead. Crap. Ah, oh, damn it. Stab him! Stab him! Get him! Oh! Did I miss it? <laughs> Got you! Hit him again! Hit him again! You're nearly headless, bro! Oh! Someone get Griff! Get Griff! Alright, well I'm I'm probably dead. I'm probably dead. That's great. Somebody kill Griff! Somebody kill Griff! Kill Griff! Great. <laughs> ah, come on. No! Oh, no! Crap. Ah, oh, right in the same spot. Ah, damn it. Oh, my is dead. Where's Beshka? Get to kill him! He's right there! Kill him! He's right there! The North remembers! Duncan! Oh, God! 
We have to get you out of here! Yes! You must survive, Roderick. For the house. For all of us that fought on this day. Go, go, go! Horse, no. go! How am I not falling off? <laughs> oh, and he, Duncan's dead. How am I staying on this horse? Uh, well, the horse is still going. That's a plus. Well, I'm glad I sent my my fiance away. Uh, what about Talia, though? Some hard decisions here. Hard decisions. <sighs> you did the right thing. I did what I had to do. He was your friend. All right. Sorry, Cotter. But I'm glad I didn't use him for blood magic. But now we have to figure out what to do to protect the North Grove. What's the point of the North Grove now? There's no foresters. Well, there's Roderick, so there's still that chance. Where's Beshka? Your arrival has changed everything. Even though we've been preparing for it all our lives, now we don't have much time. We were sent here for a reason, to protect the North Grove. Winter is coming, and we have a role to play in the war to come. Our father never would have wanted us to stand by and see how Forrester fall. Not while we can still do something about it. It's too late to reach Ironrath. It may already be lost. Grail trusted you for a reason. You know defending House Forrester is the right thing to do. You're the one they sent, Garrett. You should be the one to decide. The North Grove mustn't fall. I will respect Lord Gregor's dying words. The North Grove will never be lost while we breathe. We will defend it. That's the that's the only thing that you can really do at this point. Hopefully some other way besides blood magic. So I've got that dagger. I am now defending the North Grove with an army of blood magic people. Not an army, but like some, like a handful. All right, we do what we can. And we got Sylvie, so that's good. Watch the next game. That's probably going to be like some romance between Garrett and Sylvie. I don't even know how old Sylvie is. Probably like 15 or something. Okay. They were nothing but Stark loyalists. And the Starks are dead. Are you listening, Reek? Father wanted to make sure oh. they bend the knee. And what do I find? Oh. A child lord. 
Ethan the Wise. The Wise. With yeah. some parasite by his side. As if I'd come to negotiate. <laughs> and I thought, oh, this is going to be fun. Mira was so devoted when we first came to King's Landing. That day Cersei dragged her before the throne, Grandmother, I was actually worried for her. But she didn't have any trouble swearing loyalty to Joffrey right in front of me. And then, after that whole business with Tyrion, I thought she knew how to stay loyal when it mattered. Uh. But then there was that day when she pushed me to ask Joffrey for help, when he ripped my dress. It was bold, I'll give her that. But I can't forgive that she used me. And now, with all that's happened, the gods know what Mira was doing behind my back. Grandmother, it makes me question if she was ever loyal to me at all. I saw well? something of myself in Garrett Tuttle. I thought I could trust in him, Sam. But I was wrong. He wait, gave me I thought it- wait, no, I did trust him! he'd stay true to the vows he'd made in the Godswood. Oh, I guess that- I Yet did kind of- before her day was I? out, her brother was dead atop the wall. In self-defense, to be fair. Masters, I defended him to Frostfinger, and it cost me. Whatever happened up there, a man of the watch doesn't run away. Uh, you should return then. But another Lord Forrester. Roderick. Back from the twins with balls so shrunken he let Griff Whitehill beat him into the mud in his own yard. Reek, I had to come and see this walking tragedy for myself. But he didn't even have the courage to stab me with my own blade. Needless to say, I wasn't too impressed. And then I thought, Great, okay. Let's play a game. That's when the fun really started. There was something about Ash. You in 4.3 or was it 4.3? You would have liked him, Miss Sandai. He was rather earnest, I suppose. But he had heart, fighting with a former slave by his side. Asher needed my help. I needed to know if he deserved it, so I tested him. But there was no easy answer. They're going through all the choices here. But then he told me the truth. He'd risked losing all he had come here for to stand by his friend, a former slave. In the end, that mattered more than disobeying an order. For that, here in my help and my respect. Apparently she didn't say that. Perhaps if I had, things would have turned out differently. Loyalty. Sacrifice his life. Yeah, yeah she would only help us a little more, respect. Daenerys. Without them, we have nothing. I think, in the end, Mira came to understand that, Grandmother. She could so easily have turned on Sarah to protect herself. But instead, what she did took grace. If you're fierce enough, you leave King's Landing with your honor intact. Mira has proven that. But at what cost? Uh, and I killed Tom. Damn it. I could have told Damn him it. the story was But I lived. Bad. I didn't die. His brother dead. His mother dead. His little pile of timber in ruins. I just wish I'd been there to see it. That Bolton bastard let their upstart houses go to war, father. I'm not unfamiliar with these foresters. Stubborn to the end. They were clever, I'll give them that, but far too sentimental. <laughs> Ruled by a uh, when they should have been smart. Instinctive. I was, I was kind of smart. Uh. When will these northerners ever learn? The Starks are dead. The war is over. And they lost. So are the red fought with instinct and nobility. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> you and 35% fought with instinct and nobility. Uh, elected, uh, I don't know what that means. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. There was more red than there was blue and I don't even know if what the, I don't know. Oh, what's this? A post credit sequence? All right, so. I'm alive. 
What happened to Beska oh. and Ryan? So I'm alive. Garrett's alive. Mira's alive, but in a horrible marriage that could still save her. But he probably, that guy's probably going to try and turn on us. Morgan, he'll turn on us to try and become king. Not king, the lord. Ultric? My lord. Oh, Talia! Oh. Who's this? Ah. Who's this? Oh. We don't oh. have much time. Oh, I let him live. They may have won this battle, but they will not win this war. Okay, so Tally's alive. That's a good thing. Roiland, I let him live, so I guess he saved her. And Beshka... Oh, yes! Beshka saved Ryan! So cool, most of us are still alive. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. So, we're still alive. We're defeated, but we're still alive, and that's a good thing. All right, cool. Okay, so the majority of us told Marjorie the truth and were dismissed. 22% agreed to marry Morgan. Uh, so I guess the other, the other majority let her die with honor? I mean, I don't know. If, if I'm alive, I can still keep going. But it was kind of half and half for Cotter. And uh, we went after Whitehill and did not find Ryan. Yeah, I wanted, I, I knew, I had to take out Lord Whitehill. Like head of the snake, you know? And it was eh, almost half and half for who stayed in the North Grove. All right, see, here's the thing I that's like so stressful about this game is like, no matter what decision you make, you feel like you made the wrong one. I guess that's a good thing? Ah, I like this. I hate this and I like this. All right guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. I got more coming. Thank you for watching through all this. I'm trying to make these episodes longer so that I'm not stretching out all of the Telltale games over like a month like I have been doing. So let me know what you guys think of the new length of them. So. Thank you again, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya. That one's still alive. Just saying. Eyes are still blue. We need fire. Why? Get down. Quick time events. Oh!